It is getting ready to take down every superstar that ever was from past. We were actually the first ones here with about 30 different law enforcement at least there are three bear cats on scene here this just all unfolded sandra i would say just when we thought the diddy saga couldn't get any uglier the queen of reality television herself kim kardashian has just dropped another bombshell the internet is ablaze with scandalous accusations linking Kim Kardashian and her money-hungry clan to Diddy's illegal activities. It all started when savvy netizens noticed Kim's sudden social media purge. She followed Diddy on all platforms just a few hours before Homeland Security showed up on his doorstep in droves. Was it coincidence? Or was it a calculated move to distance herself from the storm? Clearly, there is a criminal investigation underway and that they believe that there would be evidence of crimes in one or both of these homes. But that's not all. Prepare for the jaw-dropping reveal that Kim isn't just hanging out with ditties. She's part of a mysterious Hollywood sect that profits off the deaths of fellow celebs. You heard it. While the world thought Kim made her billions through legit business deals, it turns out there's more to her success than meets the eye. How do we reward our kings? According to emerging evidence, Kim's empire may be just a smokescreen for a network of shady deals designed to enrich her with unspeakable riches. How deep does this hole go? Who else is involved in this sick story of fame, control and deceit? The scandal isn't over yet and the truth is worse than fiction. Department of Homeland Security conducting a raid at a house in Holmby Field Hills, believed to be connected to Sean Combs. As the dust begins to settle, Diddy's explosive situation is like a tapestry unraveling, revealing a web of intrigue and deceit beneath Tinseltown's glittering surface. Diddy's involvement in allegations of sexual trafficking and abuse is more than just a blot on the industry's radar. It's a Pandora's box, unleashing a tidal wave of questions and accusations that threaten to overwhelm Hollywood's elite. In this lawsuit, he claims that essentially P. Diddy was the Epstein of the rap industry. Every day brings more details that paint a picture of a dark world where power brokers control everything from the top down. Diddy's connection to a network of shady characters and shady deals suggests a deeper, darker truth underneath the surface. But how does Kim Kardashian fit in? There are rumours that Kim Kardashian and Diddy are more than just friends. There are rumours of secret meetings and behind-the-scenes deals. Kim Kardashian's empire is more than just a reality TV success story. Is her carefully curated image hiding a deeper truth of exploitation and manipulation? As the dirt on the scandal continues to unravel, Kim Kardashian's Hollywood manager, Lou Taylor, is caught up in a vicious web of exploitation. It's no secret that Lou Taylor is one of Hollywood's most powerful and influential figures. From Diddy to Justin Bieber to the entire Kardashian family, there's no denying his power and influence in Hollywood. However, it's also no secret that he's been accused of trying to manipulate some of the biggest names in the industry, including Britney Spears. Lou Taylor's alleged involvement in Spears' conservatorship scandal has sent shockwaves through the entertainment industry, but it looks like he's got even more behind the scenes. With reports surfacing that he tried to manipulate not only Britney Spears, but Lindsay Lohan as well, Lou Taylor's reputation as a power grabber is getting worse by the day. Power, greed and manipulation are all part of the Tinseltown legend. It really did open the floodgates, as you said, because it detailed almost two decades of hidden coercion. But what does Kim Kardashian have to do with all this? As Nityans analyze every unfollow, rumors swirl that Kim and Lou Taylor may be more than business partners. Some say Kim's empire is built on reality TV star stardom. Others say Kim may be tainted by her association with Lou Taylor's alleged black hat schemes. In Hollywood, loyalty comes at a price. Birds of a feather come in many varieties. Conservatorship, a lot of people are concerned for her right now. Robin, the conservatorship. I mean, people really think that maybe she needs help at this point. In the midst of this chaos, however, one thing is clear. The Hollywood elite are not above scandal. From Britney Spears' shocking revelation about the conservatorship to the allegations surrounding Dee Dee and Lou Taylor, we have seen the industry's rotten underbelly at every turn.
As the dust begins to settle, one can't help but ask, what are the other skeletons in the closet of the rich and famous? As Brittany continues to struggle for her life, her story is a lesson for anyone who wants to challenge the establishment. In a world where money talks and power corrupts, the cost of fame is far beyond anyone's imagination. Now let's dive into the web of accusations surrounding Yi and Kim Kardashian, as well as the dark underbelly of Hollywood manipulation. Yi's explosive allegations paint a picture of an industry beset by deceit and control. There used to be no end to the drama when it comes to the life of Britney Spears. Once America's sweetheart, the headlines have now turned ugly. NBC's Peter Alexander has the latest. In a series of shocking tirades, Yi accused some of Hollywood's biggest names, including LeBron James, Jay-Z, Beyonce, and more, of being manipulated and sacrificed to the industry's dark forces. Yi didn't hold back in his accusations, accusing everyone from LeBron to Beyonce of being manipulated by Hollywood's dark forces. Perhaps most shocking of all was Yi's description of his own family's heartbreaking losses, including the death of his mother Donda West, whom he said was sacrificed to Hollywood's dark agenda. Did everybody think I'm crazy? You already took my family away. You already separated all my friends. I don't got no celebrity friends. As the tirades went on, he went on to mention Michael Jordan and the deaths of Bill Cosby's and Dr. Dre's sons, implying that their deaths were part of a plan to keep the industry in check and create fear. The idea of Hollywood victims sent shockwaves through the industry. But Yee's stories didn't end there. That's all for today. See you tomorrow.